Good afternoon. You can hear Big Ben in the background. We're in Westminster and I just wanted to try and find another avenue to be able to communicate and explain what's going on in Westminster. We have my weekly newsletter that goes out, an e-newsletter. If you're not subscribed to it, contact me and I'll make sure we get you on the list or go to brandonlewis.co and have a look at that there. You can sign up on the website. This week's been a busy week in Westminster. We've had the lobbying bill where we've got the protections in there for charities now, so that works. We've also had the announcement of the Royal Mail privatisation, something that will allow that organisation to continue to grow and be a great British institution with statutory protection for the six-day delivery. We've had the G20 uh, statement from the Prime Minister outlining the results of that G20 conference and pushing that work for international aid to go out and make sure we do our humanitarian work properly for Syria. I've also had meetings around dredging and the impacts that can have on Great Yarmouth's coastline to make sure that we've got our coastline well protected. I've also met with fellow Norfolk MPs with Ofsted to discuss the situation regarding education in Norfolk and the County Council's future plans to make sure we have a great education sector in Norfolk. There's work to do on that and we're keeping an eye on that and talking to Ofsted to make sure it's moving in the right direction. We're seeing benefits of improved education in Yarmouth, with, particularly with academies like Ormiston Academy and Great Yarmouth Primary and our other schools who are all working so hard to give our children fantastic education. We've also had organisations like Breast Cancer Awareness here this week, making sure that we do our bit to promote awareness of breast cancer and early detection of it. And I'll be talking about a few of these things in my next newsletter in a bit more detail. For now, we still have another day of sitting here in Parliament with a sitting Friday this week. So still more work to do, but making sure that I keep you fully informed of what's going on here in Westminster for Great Yarmouth. And we've also this week had some really good news around employment figures. Unemployment in the country has dropped. Employment is now up 1.4 million on 2010. And in Yarmouth ourselves, we've seen a fall in unemployment year on year, which is great news. But it's just a start. And I'll be publishing details soon of my jobs fair we'll be holding before Christmas. And I hope people will be able to take part in that, benefit from that, to further drive this work to make sure that we get people into work and to make sure work pays. Thanks for taking the time to watch this and I'll be making sure we do this regularly to keep you up to date with what's happening here in Westminster.